Hi everybody, how are you? Here it's Lauren. Welcome to a new video in our channel, Only Shade Drops. We're going to review today the semi-final two songs. Sadly, Green Oscar isn't there. He's not feeling well, so I'm doing the video all by myself. So, hope you're gonna enjoy it. So, let's start now with Finland so Finland I like the song composition is good building up well and all but <laughs> first of all the vocals he, he sound like fried chicken I'm sorry but the vocals are just bad the song is good but his vocals in the national final I thought were acceptable but like in that rehearsal clip then we saw it sounded like fried chicken. Then, the staging, it's like if 2TP was the stage director, all this yellow, I don't like all this yellow. And d did you all see that, that shot of him with a balloon, like that, staring at you? Hi Pennywise, do you want a balloon? Please. Okay, I think... I, it's not a safe qualifier at all. But I real I like the song, but I if it's if it qualifies, it's going to be borderline at best. Well, good luck and all. That. Yeah, the staging needs to be changed. The singer needs to have great vocals and all. Yeah, it's going to be complicated for uh, Finland. So. Second one, Israel, Michael Ben David, I am. So here he has very great vocals. He's a great singer. The song is catchy. The high notes are fire. <laughs> Just why did you put flute? Why? Why the flute, please? Why the flute in that instrumental part? I mean, everything is good. You have perfect thing and all, and you add flute. I like flute, but I don't know. It wasn't necessary. I think it doesn't really fit the song. But well, I sadly can't really see it qualifying. But I would be happy if it does, cause it's good song. Michal is a great singer and all. Yeah. Oh, this shit is going fast. Okay, so now the third one is Serbia. I know Green Oscar loves Serbia. He would say right now that it's art and all. But I say that. Okay, get all the children out. Lauren's going to talk crap. Serbia is just. Yeah, no, well, it's just bad. I don't like it at all. Like she's talking well, washing her hands. Where what should I like in this? She seems like a sweet person and all but I just don't like the song. I'm sorry Serbia. Yeah, really sorry and bookmakers are making this tense for the win. I can't see it even qualifying. I'll be shocked if it does tonight. Well, I wish them good luck. And I don't like it really. This, it, the production is good, I have to admit it, but it just doesn't work for me. It doesn't at all. There are things like that song that you can't connect to. Well, now just after my last it's my third Azerbaijan the emotion gorgeous vocals beautiful song Nadir has such a voice I I love it he hits those notes hard it's an amazing song it should qualify it's like third in my ranking I love it it's pure emotion it brings you to another world I, I'm I'm hyped the staging looked very good 
Yeah, I really wanted to qualify. It's my favorite Azerbaijan entry. And yeah, amazing entry. Bellissimo. <laughs> and no, I'm not Italian. <laughs> and yeah, I think uh, jury will like it. Televote, so I'm not sure. I'm not sure at all because yeah it should qualify and I think it might uh, I think it will qualify but it will be borderline borderline qualifier and I hope it does because amazing song beautiful vocals it's gorgeous next one Georgia Georgia so <laughs> the thing is I don't know what to say it's such a weird song but it actually works I like it and yeah <laughs> I don't know what to say about it I saw that rehearsal snippet and the camera work looked nice vocals didn't really convince me live but I don't think it's qualifying George is sending really risky stuff and I like them for that but it's a good song it's nice original and all but yeah that's it it's I wish them best of luck it would be really a surprise if they qualify and I'm living for this kind of surprises so we why not <laughs> then after this Malta <laughs> I like this song but I hate the fact that they did a national final people voted used the money to vote in this national final a song wins the singer goes to Eurovision the singer Emma says that people in Europe didn't really like the song I loved it but and then she decides to do another song to take actually a reject from Melody Festival like why do such why do you do such a thing okay say so yeah I'm supposed to talk about the song it's a good song but it sounds really like a reject from Melody Festival it's the most Swedish thing ever I like it, the juries will like it, but I think Televote will sink it, even if it, it has chances, it has its chances, but if it, I see it coming like 6 or 7 in the jury votes, and then like 14 in Televote, so it can make it, I, yeah, it, I think there are nine pretty safe qualifiers and then for the tenth place it's between uh, Finland and Malta and Ireland it's between those three I think so yeah that's it okay next one now is let me see suspense San Marino uh, <laughs> okay so I don't really like it it's like and what the hell are these sounds Achille is making in the second chorus I, I he's making some strange sounds and all I don't know and the performance is fire honestly his performance is fire I just don't like it even if I think it's a safe qualifier because of that performance it seemed very strong and yeah, I'm curious to see it live yeah I'm not a fan of the song but that performance I think should be I sh should really watch it because he's a good performer honestly and yeah, San Marino's qualifying for sure. So next one, ah, Australia. Sheldon Riley, not the same. 
probably the strongest vocalist of the year with with many others yeah his vocals are gorgeous the song I don't mind the fact that the chorus is pretty repetitive but people are complaining and all the chorus is repetitive but it's good so just repeat it as much as you want as long as it's good and this one is a very good one especially because of Sheldon's vocals that man has such a voice it's wonderful wonderful oh my god I love it it's in my top 10 I hope it qualifies really <laughs> he will qualify like jury are gonna eat this it, it, they're gonna love it tell a vote a bit less but still it's going to qualify I don't know if it can get like a top 10 in the final but it has chances and all yeah really good luck Australia you deserve it Sheldon is amazing the song is great the emotion I like the moment when he just takes his mask off and starts almost shaking and crying and it's so emotional and I love it good luck Australia next one Cyprus Andromache <laughs> so yeah th the, the fact that it's in Greek is really good because I missed some Greek song Greek at snow and all in Eurovision cause we missed this ethnic sounds the song is very nice vocals are really good the staging looked also amazing I think it's safe qualifier surely the things really do like Elena Zagarino and Tamta in the final probably I don't think Cyprus is getting a top 10 but it, it, they'll get a, a final yeah and I like the song it's a great song she has great vocals and all yeah nice job Cyprus and now Ireland Brookie <laughs> just it's, it's a catchy song <laughs> she she's she's a lovely person and the song is great and she sings it well her performance is really good she's an amazing performer and I I th first thought it was dead but like after seeing some snippets of performance I think she she can make it she has a chance she can really bring Ireland back to the final and Ireland was robbed last year M Leslie was amazing so I wish for that she'll qualify she changed the staging from the national final I thought the national final staging were, was kinda cute and childish I liked it but this one looks way more professional and yet yeah, Ireland can do it and just after Ireland what do we have we have <laughs> a song I love so much and I know it's not going to qualify but it's life and yeah it's North Macedonia it's second in my ranking Andrea is wonderful the song is so emotional so good the emotion is real there really and also she's, I don't know I'm already very sad because it's surely not qualifying and it's making me so sad I really wish it will it qualifies really and this is just make this qualify now I'll be so so happy it will be like the best your it's already like like the best Eurovision ever for me but just make Estonia and North Macedonia qualifying I will be in <laughs> it will be paradise for me N yeah the the staging looked wonderful like w really wonderful I love it I just I love it it's <laughs> I get goosebumps just talking about it so yeah okay n next 
You could think I can't like a song more than nor North Macedonia, but I do. Estonia. <sighs> Let them tell us what to do. Why, why, why. Stefan, wonderful singer. Surely one of the best singer of the edition. The song is amazing. This why, why, why. I love how he sings it. It's, the lyrics here are very important. They are bringing hope in terrible moments and I think it's going to do very well I think it's for sure top 10 and it can go top 5 and maybe Biased because it's my number 1 of the year but it's such a great song it's wonderful I love it so much and yeah it should qualify it will qualify like if it doesn't qualify just uh, people taste this <laughs> I, I yeah no okay so next one now ah Romania hola mi bebe hola mi bebe yamame 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 I love this it's so catchy the performance is fire I love Andre, he's such a good person, such a good singer also. The instrumental part after the chorus is everything. Oh my god, that part. <gasps> so, 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 so good. Like, yeah, I don't think it will qualify, but I just hope so. The staging! Oh my god, this staging is like this little rain of yellow rain falling from the sky and I love it <laughs> oh, yes I love almost everything in the semi-final it's so good yeah go Romania get this qualify spot it's like my 15th but I love it so much it, it's showing you how much I love this edition next one is Poland ah <laughs> I always dreamed to have Ochman in Eurovision. I love his songs. Velki Titule, Prometheus, Tensamia, very underrated one. So yeah, I really wanted to have him in Eurovision. He's a great singer. Voc the, the high notes are... Yeah, how? Just how can you hit such high notes? And He's amazing. I think he could have done better, but still it's in my top 10. Because it's wonderful, and the fact he could have done better just is showing the quality of what the singer is bringing day after day with all these new songs. He's an amazing guy, amazing singer, vocals and all. He's probably the best singer vocally wise in uh, in this Eurovision. Yeah, and it's a contender for the win. It will be, uh, I think, six between fourth place and sixth place in the final. Can even get a podium. Yeah, there are many contenders this year, and it's one of them. Uh, yeah, I hope it's going to do well. Go Poland! Oh my God, why do we have so much good songs here? Montenegro is the next one. It's my number six. And I will say it now, this is qualifying, the juries will make this qualify, for sure, it's just such a gorgeous song, the vocals are amazing, the song is so emotional, like, she's talking about her mother and all, it's, I'm weak for songs like that, I'm really weak, and, I love it, it's, then, she will qualify I'm sure of this and the last part in Italian apparently they'll sing it in Italian the last part I heard it that part hits hard get ready people get ready because that part is really pure emotion and if she nails it like she did in the jury show it's qualifying for sure Next one is one of my two countries here. Yeah, I'm Belgian and Moroccan. 
so yeah Jeremy is a great singer his vocals are fire the song it's good he could have done much better and I'm very worried because his vocals in the jury show were not good at all no 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 and I was wishing for juries I thought juries could save him they won't save him Televote won't save him Belgium is dead Belgium is going to die in a ditch sadly so yeah it's not in my turn qualifiers but I I hope it would qualify because yeah you know sadly I don't think it will even if it's a good song great singer but yeah he's a great singer but just can't sing it live from yeah, in the jury show he couldn't sing it live I hope he will sing it well in the in the public show on TV show okay still two to go Sweden now one of the contenders for the win emotional song her voice like you hear like a grain of of sand in her voice and I just love this kind of voices the song is emotional her voice cracks sometimes and it's made on purpose I think and it's only making the song more emotional because she's feeling it from all her soul and yeah it will qualify for sure like there's not a world where Sweden is not qualifying well most of their songs deserved to not qualify but this is great good job Sweden for once <laughs> ah, I'm going to get killed okay now Czech Republic the best staging of the year I'm going to tell you this if she nails these notes like she did in the jury show mama mia it's going to come top five in the televote on, of the grand final this is just show qualified great EDM song like I had it at like 20th place but right now it's just skyrocketing in my ranking it's soon going to get in my top 10 top 10 I guess it's such a good song my god and <laughs> She's showing Pia how to sing EDM a great. Sorry for that. <laughs> yeah, it's going to qualify. It's don't underestimate Czech Republic. It's a dark horse, really. So, if you like the video, don't forget to put a like, subscribe, and don't forget to join our Discord channel. Link is in description. Tomorrow we'll probably react to the qualifiers and to the big five. Stay tuned. Bye bye.